Hey guys, this is Jeff from Tactical Kinetics. We're gonna talk about how to make a pistol barrel. What we do is we load a bar of 48 inch 416R stainless steel into our Iamca bar loader. It's going into the lathe where we do a mill turn operation to um, turn the OD of the barrel, thread, and then we create what we call is a lollipop for our five axis milling operation. After the OP20 process where we've created a lollipop for this SIG P365 threaded barrel, we are going to put it into our five axis milling machine. Okay, so we saw OP20 on the pistol barrel where we created our lollipop. Now it's gone through our operation 30 and you can see we've put a chamber and feed ramp on the barrel. We've created the locking block geometry and also put the chamfers on for fitting, for fitment into the slide. Next step as we go through our OP30 process is the barrel needs to be tumbled. This being a threaded barrel, we're gonna protect the threads. So put a thread protector on. We're gonna turn the tumbler on. There goes the barrel. That barrel will stay in the tumbler for a prescribed time. It'll turn off and then we'll go to the next process. Barrel's been tumbled. So now we're gonna go into an ultrasonic wash to get the soap and debris from the tumbling media off of the barrel. So the next step in making this P365 barrel will be to go into our automated honing machine. It's an eight station progressive hone to create the finished bore size and surface finish of the barrel prior to broaching. Patrick is going to show you how to broach a barrel now. So the barrel is in the fixture. He's locked the barrel in place. And now the broach is cutting the one in 10 twist nine millimeter rifling. He's just deburred the barrel, and now that'll go back to our washing station to remove the broaching oil. The final step in manufacturing this P365 barrel will be to blast it before outside processing for heat treat and coating. This is your post-blast surface finish. And that's how we make a pistol barrel at Tactical Kinetics.